Welcome to Asim Code. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like my video. In this video, we will learn about a memory profile module in Python. The memory profile module can be used for monitoring memory consumption in a process, or we can use it for a line by line analysis of the memory consumption of our code. Since it's not included with Python, we will have to install it. We can use a pip3 command for this. So on terminal, uh, I'm using Visual Store Studio code. And on this terminal, uh, I will type pip3 install memory profiler and just hit enter. I, I have already installed this on my system, but you can use this command if you don't have this uh, on your system already. So I have this uh, on my system. I just need to clear the terminal and write a code. First, I'm going to import memory profiler and then I'm going to define our function. We need to use a decorator on the function we are profiling. So I will add over here at memory profiler dot profile. And then we are going to define our function, a big array. And in this function, we are going to create a two arrays, large arrays, and this will be uh, the first array will be x, and then we are going to multiply with 10 to the power of 5, and then we will have another array y, and set into 10 to the power of 7 and then we are going to use a del keyword to delete the memory used by array y so this will be del y and i'm going to these are just a two a straight one is extra and then i'm going to return x And now from main, we are going to call our function. This will be if name equals in. Then we are going to call our uh, function big array and run our program we need to run our code with a python 3 and we need to add m parameter on the command line to load the module and run it against our script so i need to add dash m then memory profiler and then here is the path to my script and just hit enter here is the output the columns are pretty self-explanatory this and we have our line numbers memory usage and the increment increment field which tell us the difference in memory of the current line versus the line previous the very last column is for the code itself. And we can see over here, uh, the memory uh, decremented when we deleted the memory for our array Y. So the memory was released. I will just clear the terminal. The memory profiler also includes mprof which can be used to create full memory usage report over time instead of line by line. 
and it, it is also very easy to use we can type mprof run and the name of our script mprof run and the path to our script and just hit enter and here is the output mprof can also create a graph that shows uh, us how our application consume memory over time to print the graph we need to type this command mprof and mprof then just plot and hit enter and here is the plot he created for us so this is a very nice uh, module for memory profiling to keep on learning please subscribe to my youtube channel awesome code like my video keep supporting me and thank you for watching uh, just for information you need to have matplotlib uh, installed on your system if you don't have you can use uh, the command pip3 install matplotlib thank you